Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, Mamas Unite. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the LV Stride Breast Pump. I just got it in the mail. Um, I've never used it before. I have a friend who had a baby and she's been using it. It's completely hands-free. So I have a Spectra S1 breast pump. So if you've never seen my review of that breast pump, I will put the link of the video in the description below. But for baby number two, I figured it would be helpful to have my hands free where I could actually walk around while pumping and it be quiet and discreet. So I'm gonna give this one a shot and we can unbox it together. Okay, you guys, so here is the box. Um, I know the angle is probably not perfect. I, I did the best I could so you could see everything. And then front of the box here says LV Stride, quiet hands-free electric breast pump. So it looks like you've got the two pumps and then this control that does have to be hooked to you, but my friend says she just hooks it you know, to her waistline and then just wears, if she's going out, she'll just wear like a big jacket or something and you can't really tell that she, you're pumping. So I kind of figure that's what I'll do. Um, it seems that there might be a lot of parts. So let's, let's take a look. All right, so it's packaged nicely. I'm gonna try to do this so it doesn't knock over. Okay, so. Let's see. Looks like here's the remote. And it's pretty small. Of course, they always do such a good job with the packaging. Okay, so let's see. Okay. So here is the remote here, power button here, and then we'll have to go through the manual. It looks like there's a, a play pause plus minus, and then there's a teardrop. Um, so we'll figure out what that means, but um, it's not very heavy. It's pretty lightweight. So I feel like we'll be, I'll be fine wearing this around on my waist or even in my pocket, I could even do that. So there's that guy. And then we have, here's one of the, one of the pumps. Squeeze it out of here. Okay, oops. So here's the pump. Looks like this is the back. So your breast will go here and then this will come off, I'm sure. the cow this is not really tight there we go okay so here it is opened up so you've got the collection cup and then this looks like the duck bill right here and then this looks like the membrane so we'll play around with all this stuff and I'm sure once I once I learn it it'll become second nature just like the spectra did okay so here we have looks like the charging cable very nice Here's the instructions, which we will need. Here's the other pump. So they're, yeah, they're pretty small. I got the 24 millimeter, I think. Not totally sure. Um, I ordered this a while ago and then it took a little while to get it because my, I had to get the prescription for my doctor. So here looks like, here's the case for the carrying case for the, um, the holder, so that's nice. And here's the little clip, it'll clip right on your pan, so that's cool. What's this? Okay, here we have the cords. Okay, so these will connect, these will connect one to each somewhere. Probably just go like this, looks like. Looks like it'll fit just like that. So one in here and then, yeah. Okay, cool. That's pretty easy. Okay, so that's really it. I think cleaning this might be a pain in the tush just because this is a closed system. So 
you don't have to worry about cleaning the tube but all of these parts I mean you'll have to disassemble and make sure that you get them really clean so those are the parts here's the instruction manual I'm not gonna bore you guys with all of this but okay so yeah you've got your stopper your cup seal diaphragm of course i don't know all the technical terms but that's what we're working with valve brush shield so you get you get it lists all the parts that you get you also can download um they have an app an lv app so you can track your sessions control lv stride remotely personalize your pump preference so my friend told me that once you, you have to play around with it in the beginning, and then once you figure out your settings, it will remember it. So you don't have to reset it every time that you use it. And then you charge it, blah, blah, blah. Okay, and then here's all of your parts. So charging port, charging cable, hub connector, the controls. So that teardrop is the mode mode yes okay so play pause intensity power intensity light okay cool awesome so um i'll go through this um and then i'm gonna do a review of this pump once i start using it and then i will do a comparison of versus video of the spectra versus the um lv so it looks like here they tell you what to wash and what not to wash. So the only things you wash are the breast shield, the diaphragm, the cup seal, the valve, and the stopper. So everything else, the cords, the, the charging, the cover, all that, it doesn't have to wash. So you don't have to wash too much, which is great. Um, and then obviously you want to make sure that you have a separate bin for washing your pump parts. You don't want to put it just straight in the sink because there's a lot of bacteria. You want to have something, soap and a brush and a bowl that's dedicated just for your pumping parts. So um, I will get a bowl. I, I used to have one when I was breastfeeding with James. I'll get a new one uh, for this baby. And then it just talks about fitting, how it fits. So obviously if it doesn't fit i'll have to get a new a new size but and then it tells you how to put it together so you attach the cover and clip so i want to try to take this apart and put it together just so we can kind of learn together how to do it okay so here's, the, uh, what's that called? I think it's called the hub. And you've got this guy. How do you take this out? Okay, you got this. And then you've got this part, this part. Okay, you got this. Does this come apart? I don't know if this comes apart. I don't think so. Okay, so is it only four parts? Might, that might be it. Yeah, okay. So what you're gonna do first is you're gonna take this part here. This is all connected. And then you put the, the little bill in the bottom right here. Push it in there. And these are all like a soft silicone. This is plastic, this is silicone. And then after that, you're gonna attach this guy, which will just fit like that. You gotta make sure this is secure or else it's not gonna extract the milk properly. So this one, I think you have to, you have to really squish it in here. This is gonna take some practice for me just because I obviously have never used this. So 
just want to make sure that it's really secure. I wonder if it goes... There's like a lip right here, if you guys can see it. I'm just trying to squeeze it into that part. Okay, there we go. That was a little bit easier. You have to like lift it up and then push it real hard in there. Okay. Perfect. Okay, and then after that, you take this part and it fits right over the top like this. And then you're gonna really squeeze it to make sure it's secure. Okay. So there we have that. Okay, check that the diaphragm is completely dry. You don't want any moisture. Okay, and then let's see. I think we're gonna take the cord. Um, single side pumping. You only need one short tube that connects to one cup. Okay, so let's see. Turning it on. Okay. I just wanted to see how to connect it. So if you see this picture here, you, it looks like it both connect and then it clips. You wanna rotate the cap so it's the most, six, six, what's the word? Discreet. Okay. So then you would take one of these, one of these guys You'll put it on here, it clips in, that's super easy. And then this will go in your bra. And then, then you'll clip this part into here. I'm trying to do this in, in screen. Okay, put it in here, okay. Very nice. And then I obviously need to charge it. This thing isn't charged, so um, that's why it's not turning on. And then to charge it, let's see. Plug in the hub for five minutes to wake it up before first use. It will not turn on while it is charging. It takes approximately two hours to fully charge. A full charge lasts five 30 minute sessions so that's pretty good that's not too bad okay so that's basically it you guys um you're learning along with me so when i start using this i will do a review video and then um i'll let you know my thoughts in comparison with the spectra um i'm excited to use this so i can actually like do the dishes or even drive in a car and you know walk around not have to like sit holding I do have a hands-free um, pumping bra for the spectra but it's different you know the the collection cups are just different so this is much more discreet so I'm very excited to use this thank you guys for tuning in for another video this was my first unboxing so thank you for staying tuned bearing with me as I kind of figure things out with this breast pump but it looks like it's gonna be super convenient. I'm very excited to use it, especially when I'm traveling and stuff. So like I said, I'll give an update video and once I start using it, baby girl is due in less than five weeks. So um, it might be a little while till that video is posted, but I will give you my thoughts and my pros and cons and all of that. So I will um, keep you guys posted and thank you so much for tuning in and I'll see you in the next video.